uh, ahead of its next token unlock event, the sandbox holders have increasingly sent the metaverse-based token to cryptocurrency exchanges for onward sales. Uh, with an exchange inflow of 81 million sand on 10th of August, the altcoin recorded its highest number of tokens sent to exchanges since February. Data from CryptoQuant revealed an $81 million sand flowing into exchanges. 70 million million went into Binance as 6 and 73 million sand or 16% of current circulating supply will be unlocked tomorrow. Again, Julio Moreno, August 13, 2023, according to Token Unlocks, the unlock event will see the release of 332.55 million SAND tokens into circulation. This represents 16.16% of the token's total circulating supply. The tokens will be unlocked from the Sandbox Genesis smart contract and distributed to the team 71.25 million SAND, company reserve, advisors, strategic sale participants, and seed sale participants in 102.96 million sand. Now, some generally token unlock events uh, can be bearish for an asset's price as they inject uh, previously uh, frozen liquidity into the market. For crypto assets with low traction, the increase in supply is not often met by a corresponding uptick in demand, therefore putting downward pressure on the price on-chain assessment of SAN's price has revealed that new holders of the soon-to-be-distributed tokens may sell off their newly unlocked tokens. For one, holding on to SAN has been a significantly unprofitable venture for many. An assessment of the alts in the money and out-of-the-money metrics on Into the Block confirmed this. These metrics are used to identify addresses likely to be selling similar or buying tokens and to track the market's overall sentiment. Uh, addresses said to be in the money hold their coins at a profit. Conversely, those out of money book losses on their investments. At the time of writing, only 2.29% of sand holders held the metaverse token in the money. Around 194,000 addresses, which represented 96.36% of all sand holders realize losses on their holdings and it's it's been in May's view but at the end of the setting of the second price it is far an attempt we brought always built and that said that the rest of the future is environmental of value tokens network activity investors stay their hands data from Sandimit showed that the count of daily active addresses that completed sand transactions has dropped by 67 percent since 21 p.m. July. Likewise, the new demand that might drive up the assets price has been non-existent. The daily count of new addresses created to trade sand has fallen to a two-month low. On a daily chart, key momentum indicators remain flat and have been so positioned in the last week. This suggested that sand accumulation has slowed as many traders have stayed their hands ahead of the unlock event. Uh, since the month began, sand's price has trended downward. Uh, Exchanging hands at 39.45, its value uh, has since dropped by 6%. Um, this decline has been due to a decrease in the token's network activity. Uh, data from Santinet showed that the count of daily active addresses that, that completed SAN transactions has dropped by 67% since the 21st of July. Likewise, the new demand that might drive up the asset's price has been non-existent. The daily count of new addresses created to trade SAN has fallen to a two-month stop, and that in every fortune itself. On a daily chart, key momentum indicators remain flat and have been so positioned in the last week. This suggested that SAN accumulation has slowed as many traders have access to a PM safe, stayed their hands uh, uh, ahead of the unlock event. Um,